This is DSU News with Shay Nasty, baby! You know, they really missed it, dude, when it comes to marketing this movie. I mean, I think they should have called this one Poo 2. What are you going to do? I don't know. Anyhow, I just feel it would have been catchier. Now, the director for this one now, same director from the first one, is back for this one. He has promised this one's going to be bloodier because it has a bu- bigger budget, more kills, nastier, this and that, better fucking makeup, blah, blah, blah. Anyhow, though. Here's the plot for the new installment. So deep within a hundred acre woods, a destructive rage grows as Winnie the Pooh, Piglet, Owl, and Tigger find their home and their lives endangered after Chris or Robin revealed their existence. Not wanting to live in the shadows any longer, the group, the group decides to take the fight to the town of Ashdown, home of Chris or Robin, leaving a bloody trail of death and mayhem in their wake. Winnie and his savage friends will show everyone that they are deadlier, stronger, and smarter than anyone could ever have imagined, and get their revenge on Christopher Robin once and for all. Dude, they even have a kid poo for a flashback scene in this one. God damn. I mean, after watching the trailer, I mean, I will say the costumes and makeup do look better. And let's be real, the last one was just pretty bad. I mean, come on, dude. They tried to make it more serious themed and, you know, and the fact that they want us to believe that these dudes in masks were actually real life-size animals, it just didn't work. And just the dramatic scenes were just over dramatic. just, oh God. And now we go to the sequel where yes, from the trailer, you can tell it has a bigger budget for sure. And the masks look better and all that good stuff, right? But it seems they maintained the series tone. And me personally, I feel this would have sufficed more as a slightly kind of cheesy, dark comedic horror flick i mean you're dealing with like childhood characters and stuff though i mean you know make it a bit more fun and like i said lighter tone but you can still make it nasty and like bloody and shit you know but i don't know it is i mean i just think the audience have more fun with it especially ones who know these characters how fun would it be to see them like say some fucked up one-liners dude and like kill someone this just seems like some dramatic ass like horror flick it's just i don't know for me it doesn't really work but anyhow though I will say the bloody sequences look cool, you know. They kill the sister dude in the trailer. Black folks, we came in last in trailers now. We die in trailers. So in the first one, you know, they had only uh, Pooh and Piglet. This one includes Tigger, who looks fucked up, dude. And just as ugly looking as Owl as well, dude. I mean, they obviously both have seen better days, dude. My God. Hey, kids, check this out, though. Rumors are saying that there's supposedly a tease of other classic childhood characters that have entered the public domain and could make an appearance in this movie. I mean, maybe I should be more excited, but like I said, that last one just left a bad taste in my mouth. And of course, I'm going to watch it, of course. I mean, who knows? Maybe better than the first one. And maybe it's not as serious as the trailer portrays it, which I doubt, but I could be wrong. I hope I'm proven wrong. I will say, though, if we are going to see more of these, you know, old school, you know, childhood characters that we grew up with you know, come to life in the horror world, we need more creativity with these, dude. I mean, you know, so let's hope, uh, you know, things get better as we move along, you know, with more of these. And, you know, hopefully people aren't just using this to get a quick buck and whatnot. Now, I'm going to be real with you. I think a character that, you know, I guess recently kind of uh, passed over the domain and whatnot, public domain, would be Mickey Mouse, dude. How awesome would it be to see a cool-ass, you know, Mickey Mouse him is some, I, I would like to see him as like a gangster. You know what I'm saying, dude? Like, you know, they call him the mouse and he's kind of like the kind of Godfather style where he's got a cigar and shit, like, you know, burning people up and shit. They should make a horror style Mickey Mouse movie. Uh, oh, wait. Oh, never mind. Oh, shit. That's right. <laughs> never mind. Yeah. So anyways, that's all for today. Stay nasty, my friends. And I will see you at the next one. Shay Nasty out. I'll see you soon. Like and subscribe.